TFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 1 p.m. Eastern time on Wednesday. Three hours left to go in the trading day. And we got markets in negative territory. S&P is currently negative by 20 points, trading at 27.71. You get the Dow negative 156, trading at 25,650. And the NASDAQ currently negative 62 points, trading at 75.12. Notes and bonds, higher price, lower yield. 10-year note up 12 ticks, 122.08. 30-year bond up 23 ticks. 145.04. Gold contract up two bucks, 1287 on the dot. We have oil negative 61 cents trading at 55.96. We got EIA numbers at 10:30 Eastern time showing a build of about seven million barrels, quite a number. And dollar index basically flat trading at 96.810. We'll start it off. Let's jump over to the futures charts. We'll start it off with the Dow. So it's been quite a cascade since just before the opening bell. Putting things in context, there's your 8.30 bar. We get payrolls at 8.30, 183,000 coming in for February. You also had a revision for January going from 213 up to 300. So 87,000 added for the month of January, 183 in February. That news putting a little bit of a bid in all the markets, but it didn't take long before we sold off below those levels. You saw the Dow going from 25,829. We're now approaching almost 200 points below that level, 25,652. Putting it in context, and we're coming up to Monday's lows, which in the Dow, 25,622, pretty close. S&P's much the same, 2771. Session lows as we speak, pulling back to the lows of Monday, that level at about 2769. So you're only talking about two S&P points. NASDAQ 100, 7116. Monday's low, backing up the chart, a little bit below where we're at right now. You had a low Monday at about 7,078. So you're talking about almost 40, uh, 40 NASDAQ 100 points. Crude oil, there's some volatility for you. We get the EIA number at 1030. There's your number there. You see crude, pretty surprising too. You get a build of 7 million barrels. API was big last night, but still big build. What happens? Oil trades from 55, 46, almost a dollar topside, 56.39, currently trading at 56 on the dot. And we got gold trading at 12.8705. Stay tuned, folks. We got our man Dave White coming up live at 2 o'clock with the Power Trading Hour. Then, of course, Tom O'Brien wraps up this trading day live from 3 till 5. Stay tuned. Have a great Wednesday.